Hi, this is Nathan, your neighbor at Arcade and Pinball Talk. I'm. We're going to be reviewing Judge Dredd by Valley Pinball today on location at Rec Bar 812 in Southern Indiana. Please look for our written review underneath the description of our YouTube video. Let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? First things first, obviously uh, we're shooting on location and this game could really use some GIs or some extra lights on it. Very dark playing it. And as you can see, the right ramp access to your right end lane, have a trail. You got pop uh, drop targets in the middle of the table with, with a little scoop to the center. We're playing a super game right now, which is always the best one to play. And as you see, there's a kick out to the back right, which kicks the ball and it have a trail to the right. And it will also have a trail to the left. So we got down into the uh, the drop to the middle. Sent it to my left flipper from the center of the table. Three flipper set up. Flipper gap's not too bad. And obviously you have a uh, two in lane uh, set up to the right. You have an in lane to the left, obviously an exit lane to the left and a kickback uh, to the left of that, which is lit by the blue question mark at this point. There's the kickback. Music's not bad for Judge Dredd. I mean, actually it's jamming out. Call outs are decent for what it is. Obviously we rate older games on a different scale than newer games, obviously, because we have to rate them based off of their time. It's very hard to compare an older game to a newer game based on theme, uh, integration, fun factor, you know, art, stuff of that nature. So far, I'm pretty impressed. Judge Dredd is actually a pretty fun game. Cool uh, power could be a little bit more powerful to get up these, these ramps. And so you have, you, have, you have four flippers on this game. Three that you can visually see. So you have one on the left, middle. You have two to the front of the play field. And then you have a fourth flipper, which is up at the top right, which is going to be very hard to see on this video. There you go. Got up the ramp. Ramp comes all the way down to your right habit trail, to your right in lane. And that was the pursuit ramp. There we go. Hit it again. Try to hit it again, there we go. Almost. Art is what you would expect of a game of this age. The music's actually not bad, it's jamming out pretty good. Call outs are decent. Theme is what you would expect. There's a lot to do on this game. So it, it, it's actually pretty fast, but it is heavily blocked to the middle. This adds a layer of difficulty to the game, so it's a moderate difficulty. It's not super high. There's a lot to shoot at, which makes this really fun, a fun game. I see why a lot of collectors try to buy this game, actually. As you can see, your modes in the middle, you got Drain Shield, two, two times Blackout. Yeah, Mr. Meter, Felony, Class X Felony. These are obviously, uh, we're trying to move our way up through there. And then, of course, you got Pursuit, Blackout, Battle Tank ultimate challenge and then of course at the top of that you got fear death fire etc going through this game for the mode play so all in all not a bad game at all and like most ballet games it's it's loaded and it plays very well and it's fluid the only knack i have is how it's blocked to the middle i see why they did it obviously with that scoop that i just hit that first ball into and that will actually lock the ball and kick it back out to your left flipper I just open it back up again in the middle. Lots of multi balls. Makes this game really fun. Fast and furious in your face. So the flow is there. The shots are there. The moderate difficulty is there uh, due to the blocks. So it, it's definitely a fun game. We rate this one a 8.7 out of 10. So definitely check this game out when you get the opportunity at your local arcade and or pinball hall. Again, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball tall guy. Sign out. Thank you again for watching today. Enjoy.